Hi, this is Jason Robinson. I'm the owner of Golden Rule Auto Sales. Just wanted to take a minute to go over this uh, H2 with you. Uh, at the end of the day, obviously this vehicle is black. It's going to show a little bit of, you know, imperfections and such uh, more than a, pretty much any other color. Um, but at the end of the day, it's extremely clean. Um, now, this isn't the type of Hummer you're going to enter into a local car show, but it's about as clean as you're going to get without getting into that level of quality uh, as far as cosmetically. Um, I mean, there's really no rust. Uh, there's no dents, there's no dings. Um, obviously, these metal tubular boards down here get a little bit of flaking on the insides of them and such, but those are um, not coated from the factory that you can get those brand new at um, Summit Racing for 100 bucks a piece. Um, as far as the uh, rims, they're pitted up as they all are. Um, they all pit up uh, right around this area here, a little bit of pitting inside the clear coat. Um, I would give these for the year an 8 out of out of 10. <clears throat> um, all except this one. This one here is going to, um, it's kind of dark here. This one here has got a lot of pitting. We're going to work on it a little bit with that new type of paint. Please get back with me on that one there. Uh, this one here is in great shape. There's a new type of rim paint. Uh, we're going to experiment with that, with that one on. I'll get back with you on how well it works. Uh, again, it has the uh, towing package on the rear and it's got your luggage racks, it's got the moonroof and uh, we'll pull it inside and let you see some pictures of it inside as well. So yeah, I just wanted to take a minute here uh, just to go over a couple of things mechanically. Uh, I put over 550 some dollars in the front end. A uh, lot of repairs. Uh, if you want details about it, give me a call. I can go over it with you. Front end got a lot of good updates to it. Obviously, this is a Hummer. It's not a Cadillac. Um, you know, it's going to drive like a like a big SUV. Um, you know, not a Cadillac. So, um, you know, a lot of my Hummer drivers understand that. They've already owned one. No big deal. Um, if you've never driven a Hummer before, you may want to go test drive one, you know, before you pay me to have this shipped across the country. Uh, engine is very quiet. Uh, one of the things that's notorious with Hummers is when, it, when they first start up, there's a little exhaust donut that goes in between the header and the engine and that donut expands and contracts throughout the years and it wears down and so when you first start it up and that donut is cold you're going to hear a little bit of engine noise it's not that there's a problem with the engine it's just you're hearing a little bit of exhaust but as soon as that donut warms up it expands it's nice and quiet like it is right now the other thing uh, that the Hummers are notorious for and a lot of guys like them they just have that glass pack type of sounding exhaust to them. Not sure if you're able to hear that or not. Um, that's the way these sound, you know. Now we sell all over the country. We cannot guarantee that our exhausts standards here will pass your state's inspection so uh, w this passed our inspection there's nothing wrong with the exhaust um, you know but I, I can't guarantee it's going to pass you know California emissions things like that um, so as far as mechanically it doesn't need anything it's good to go the inside of the vehicle is as clean as you've already seen in the pictures there's no stains, there's no signs it was ever smoked in. Headliner spotless. Everything works electronically. Looks like no one ever sat in the back. There's no wear at all in the back. This back seat is immaculate.
Really, one of the only things I can think to even remotely apologize for is um, looks like at some point somebody probably put a battery down here and maybe it leaked a little bit and there's a little bit of uh, the carpet's worn out right here. Now you can get those uh, carpet mat from Walmart that fit, you know, they got different sizes and you could cover that up really easy. The only other thing I can think is uh, this has metal heated seats and as you can see this one here on the passenger side works. This one here on the driver's side is not lighting up. It's 75 degrees today. It's really hard for me to tell if it's heating up. It may heat up and not light up or it may just not work at all. I'm selling that the way it is. Just, you know, it's a middle seat, it'd be too expensive to try to fix it, and a lot of times people don't even use it. But as you can see here, the front seats work. And it has the memory seats. If you're a lot taller than your wife, you can set the seat to go any position, and also we'll move this rear view mirror as well. It's got the OnStar, the tow package, 4x4, rear dimming rear, uh, dimming rear view mirror with compass and thermostat, power moonroof, home link. It's got all the bells and whistles, Bose sound system, you name it. So if you have any questions, please feel free to give me a call on my cell phone at 330-71. Oh, I wanted to mention one more thing here, sorry wanted to mention one more thing. I'm gonna price this $250 cheaper than what I had planned to price it at. And the reason being, there's some rock chips here that maybe you could repair, maybe you couldn't. I haven't had my guy try, but there's three of them right here. And a lot of times when there's more than two, it's just as cost of effective as just to get a brand new one. Um, and so I'm going to sell this $250 cheaper so that you have money to um, put a windshield in. So, again, if you have any questions, feel free to give me a call, 715-1555.